Here we have a circle inscribed inside a square. We have to find the area of the shaded region. This area of the shaded region can be calculated if we can find first area of the square. Second, we need to find the area of the circle. And if we subtract this area from the area of the square, then we can get the shaded region. For example, if this is a square that is given, then area of the square is this. Then area of the circle, the inscribed circle will be this. And if we subtract this region from the area of the square, then we can get this part, which is the required region that we need to find. Now, area of the square, the formula is side square. Here, side given is 20 centimeter. So, it will be 20 square. 20 square is 400 centimeter square is the area of the square. Now, area of the circle will be, the formula of area of the circle is pi r square. Here, the side of the square given 20 centimeter, that means when we draw a line anywhere between the sides, a straight line, these all lines, they all are 20 centimeter. Now, if this is 20 centimeter, that means this is the diameter of the circle. If diameter of the circle is 20 centimeter, radius will be half of the diameter. Radius is equal to diameter upon 2. So, radius is 20 upon 2 that is equal to 10 centimeter. Now we can calculate the area of this circle 22 upon 7 the value of pi and radius is 10 square. So 10 times 10. So this is equal to 2200 upon 7. Now area of the shaded region is equal to area of the square minus area of the circle. Area of the square is 400 centimeter square minus Area of the circle is 2200 upon 7 centimeter square. Now, let's take out the LCM or we can put 1 here in the denominator. It's 7. So, this is 2800 minus 2200 upon 7 or 600 upon 7 or we can divide here 600 upon 7. That will be approximately equal to 85.84. So, this is how we calculate area of the shaded region. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.